Hi, this is James from Square Internet with another WordPress tutorial. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can change the PHP version for your WordPress website. This is often something that people need to do at a certain point if they want to speed up their website or just make sure that their website's not running on a really old version of PHP. You need a cPanel to follow along with this video. Most major hosting platforms use cPanel as it's the industry standard hosting platform. GoDaddy do, SiteGround do, for example. So just check first of all that you do have a cPanel within your hosting plan. All that you need to do is log into the cPanel for your hosting plan and then scroll down to the PHP version manager. In SiteGround it reads PHP version manager and I'm pretty sure off the top of my head it's exactly the same for GoDaddy. So all we're going to do is click into this and then we're going to click into the domain that we want to edit the PHP version on. This hosting counts has got a few domains in that are used for video tutorials and little experiments. So SiteGround you've got to click into the domain you want to edit the PHP version on and it's the same process for GoDaddy. What we're looking at here is a list of PHP versions. So a lot of websites are still probably still running on PHP 5.6 which was really common for the past few years. PHP 7 uh, is what a lot of people are upgrading to. Uh, there's now different versions of PHP 7. <clears throat> One thing to bear in mind is that when you're upgrading your PHP version you need to make sure that your website is going to be compatible with the new version of PHP. So there are various different ways you can test this. One way if you wanted to be safe I guess would be to duplicate your website on a domain that's not public and then upgrade the PHP version on that development domain to see if anything breaks and then if it all works okay you could upgrade the PHP version on your main website or depending on how much traffic you get you could um, upgrade the PHP version late one evening give it a test see if it works and if it does keep it there or if not just switch back to the old PHP version whatever you do with regards to upgrading your PHP version I'd recommend that you perform a full backup of the website first of all either using the cPanel full backup function or something like WordPress Pro to back it up to the cloud where you've got uh, one click restore functionality which is something that we offer our customers we can restore the website in one click for them but as you can see here's a list of the PHP versions you can select and all that you would need to do is select the PHP version that you'd like to upgrade to this hosting plan with my uh, video tutorial domain on is on PHP 7 so if I wanted to upgrade to 7.1 or 7.2 I'll just select either or of them and click save Hopefully you found this video useful and it gave you an overview of how you can edit and upgrade your PHP version. Make sure you subscribe for future videos and releasing tons of content on WordPress, WooCommerce, page builders, how to build, grow and scale WordPress websites over the next months. So make sure you subscribe so you don't miss those videos. Thanks very much for watching. Any comments let me know on the video and hopefully I'll see you on the next video. Cheers.